peeps, uh, updates you've been waiting for on the cart here. Yes, we have the gear. Yes, we have the chain. We've got two gears here uh, because I was just seeing what one was going to work better. Um, turns out that it's the one that I wanted was the small gear and uh, that's turned out uh, real nice. Uh, chain's on. Everything's a bit tight at the moment. I haven't adjusted everything yet. But um, yeah, everything's turning out good. Um, while I was doing all that last night, I really just didn't like uh, this fan. As you can see, see, even he doesn't like it. Just moves, these things are just shitty and shonking, you know, so I'm thinking taking this uh, radiator off quickly and uh, making up a, uh, a shroud for it quickly, uh, bolt, the, bolt the fan to it. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, just, just so it uh, looks a lot nicer. We're just gonna quickly take off um, up top there. In the bottom, we can actually paint up the radiator again because we've still got this little bit here as well. And um, yeah, take it off and make up a shroud for it. Get it done, eh? All right, peeps. Uh, yeah, so fan shroud's all done. Let's you know, have a look. Uh, just uh, quickly stitch welded it. Uh, made up the piece there, and uh, yeah, cut it out for the fan. Tapped out a couple of holes for it, and uh, yeah, ready to go. So uh, it's all painted up in two pack. Quickly done that. Quick hour and a half job. And yeah, it looks it looks pretty good. Still just a just a tad tacky. You just see a little fingerprint. But for the fan itself, it's alright to get back on. It's just very hot at the moment. It's been outside, that's all. So yeah, it's come up well. Um yeah, I just repainted all these bits on the side that we had to touch up anyway. I didn't bother cleaning them up because just in case it started to leak again. So uh yeah, let's um uh, get the fan back on and uh, get it back on the on the cart. So there you go. Uh, yeah, so just uh, four M4s I've got on there. Uh, a bit of Loctite tapped in and it grabs it great. So ain't going anywhere. So we can get this bad boy back on the cart now. And uh, yeah, pretty happy with how it's actually come up. So uh, yeah, pressed. All back on already. So it looks much better. A lot cleaner looking and uh, airflow shouldn't be much difference at all. Uh, normally get a little bit better airflow like this because it's just direct, it's not uh, escaping it from everywhere else, but uh, I'm pretty sure it'll be about the same anyway. I wasn't really looking forward to that, I was just looking forward to having a, uh, a nice place to mount and uh, she doesn't uh, wiggle all over the place anymore, she's all solid. So really happy with that. Um, it's all back, I can't put no water on it yet because the, the stuff's drying down there, and, uh, but it's all hooked up. So let's wait till uh, wait till it's dry and we'll put some water in it. But uh, yeah, all in all, it's all good. So this is the this is the carts all ready for um, to get the uh, chain all ready to go now. Um, as I said, the smaller one is the one I'm using. That is the bigger one, but uh, the small one is actually the the ratio exactly same as the booster. Um, yeah, so I've just got to get, get a keyway done on it now. Uh, I've just gotten the hub hubs have all made up. Thanks very much to um, good mate. So um, yeah, so let's. Um, I've got to take all this all back off um, and uh, get this uh, keyway made up and uh, get it all back in and ready to go.